bring you another Football Manager 2016 video. And let's get into another episode of my Pentagon Challenge. So, since I last saw you, we've had one game against Incheon. Incheon? Incheon? I'll get there eventually. It was Incheon, and we beat them 1-0. You know, Lee Jong-Soo scored in the second minute. Nothing else, really. You know, we played quite well, but could have been better. Koya Yoshioka fantastic once again he's incredible but apart from that we do have to win against Balena today and it's going to be huge going to be absolutely huge so obviously we have a 2-1 deficit you know they've scored two goals at home we've scored one goal away so we need at least a 1-0 win if they score then we just need to outscore them it's that simple until they get to two away goals it's, it's a bit of a problem but anyway Pereira is back. Uh, we don't have a right sided mid, uh, attacking mid. Park Suk Yong is on international duty. Vinicius is unregistered. Lee Jong Yu is unregistered. Jun is uh, on international duty. Koya is unregistered as well. It's good to see Ru J Ho having a great time out on loan. 25 starts, 12 sub appearances, and 3 goals. Terrible. Absolutely terrible. But we'll focus on our team today. Cho Hyun Wu is in goal. We have Nam Jin Ah, Yu Kyung Won, Jong Il Kun, Jong Jion, Jion, Young Ju. It's 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 getting to me. We have Kwon Chang Hun, Lee Jung Min. Then up front we have Fernando Pereira and Lee Byung Min who sit behind Lee Jong Su. So we need a win. We don't have a choice. There's nothing else to say except we need a win. So. We're the favourites. We're the favourites in the first game, and uh, now they've gone defensive. So remember, they played a four, uh, four, two, three, one. I think it was. Now they've gone for a five, three, two. They're playing with wing backs. They think that defence is the key to their success, and we'll soon yet find out. You know, we play the counter-attacking football. If they're going to defend, well, then maybe we need to attack. But we'll see how our counter-flexible system works. Normally, it plays pretty well. But uh, five at the back is something quite different. So we need a result. We need a win more than anything. We do need a win. Are we going to pick one up though? I don't really know. I'm hoping. It's Champions League. We need it. So here we go. The first heart of the game. John's made a good interception. And he's Lee jong Su. Can he hold up? He can. He finds Pereira back from his injury. There's Fernando on the right. What's he going to do? Can he get past the, the defender? He can. He beats him. He comes down this right-hand side. Whip it in. Lee jong Su. We're back into it straight away. 15 minutes down. Fernando is fantastic on that right-hand side. My God, Fernando. Ugh, what a play. There he is. He beats the man. Beats the second man. Gets it all. A bit of a heavy touch. All the way to the byline. Lee jong Su unmarked. Thank you very much, he says. And now we're, we're technically winning. We are technically winning, so I'm more than happy. Fernando, Lee jong Su, great work there, boys. Can't have asked for more, but here we go. There's another highlight. Here's Pereira. He whips the ball to Fernando, who beats one, but he's tackled. Now, we need to defend this. Can we get there? You does. Lee jong Min. here's Pereira. Out to Fernando. What can he do on this right-hand side? He beats one. He's in the box. Pereira, Fernando, goes to the byline. Back post. Oh, Lee byung Min. He's hit the crossbar. The man in form has hit the crossbar. Pereira on the corner. Nothing comes from it. Are they going to have a counter-attack here? Looks like they could. Need to watch out for this number 11. Could be a problem. He's Saguta. He's Asabi. Number 11. Nishimura out on the right-hand side. Pereira, you need to close down Saguta. He's Nishimura. Need to be careful of number 11. Takaha jong il Kun. Fantastic tackle. Very lucky there. And we've survived. We have survived there. Shame we've hit the crossbar, but we need another goal. Here we go. Here's Pereira. Front post. Jong Il Kun can't get there. Lee Byung Min, the man in form. Can you find Nam Jin Ah? Fernando's there. Here he is. Fernando. He's, oh, he avoids the challenge. Oh, spill from the keeper. And Lee Jung Min can't. Fernando is playing fantastic on this right hand side. Absolutely incredible. I don't know where he's better now, the right hand side. Or the shadow striker. But he's on an 8.2. And it's not even half time. He's playing out of his skin right now. And uh, it looks like we could go into half time with a 1-0 lead. Which is fine by me. We're doing well. And I'll tell the boys. Fan bloody tastic. More than happy. We have half an hour. Well, not half an hour. We have half half a game to hold out. 
45 minutes. That's what I was trying to say. Here's Lee Jung Min. Here's Fernando on this right-hand side again. Can he beat the man? Oh, he can't. Unfortunately, this time he can't. But what do you know? He's still on an 8.2. He's still playing well. And we've got 40 minutes left to hold on. 40 minutes. Will we go defensive? There's a chance we will. There is a very good chance. Here we go. Tamaoki has taken a really weird free kick from the throw-in. Here we go. Fernando comes down the center. He's been tackled. Sagutz is on a yellow. He's off. He's off, ref. Show that red. He is done. His game is over. That's fantastic for us. Are they going to change their system now? That's the question. We will bring this up here. Can I? Where's my little box here? We want to check the Balin formation. Well, they've gone still with a 5-3-1. We'll leave it on this right-hand side. They're still playing with the wing backs. They've just left a man up top. So whether they're going to do something with this or not, I don't know. But they're playing a 5-3-1 now. Here we go. Pereira. Lee Byung Min can't get there. Here's Pereira, though. Can he whip in a second ball? He can't. He's got it again, though. Pereira. Back to Jion. Jion. You need to reload. He's Lee Jung Min. Pereira. Lee Jong Su. He's through. It's a goal. Is it counted? It's not offside. It's 3 2. We have two goals here. Now they need a goal. If they grab a goal, then we do go to extra time. But they're still playing the 5 3 1. Pereira. That's a great through ball. Lee Jong Su had no idea what he was doing. And then their keeper is having an absolute nightmare. Absolute nightmare. But the 5 3 1. Isn't working for them. Let's make some changes now. We've got 15 minutes left to play. Jong, you're looking tired, but you're not coming off. Here's Kim. Prera, off. Kim, drop back. We're playing five at the back now, too. Limited defender stopper. Why not? Now, Kim Hyuk. I do want to bring him on, but I don't want to drop this. Fernando, Lee Byung Min can drop left. We don't have anyone that can play on the right-hand side, though, which is a bit of a problem. Do we have... Uh, no, we don't have anyone. So we need to think here. Kim Hyuk can come on for a defensive midfielder, and maybe we go like this. Take Lee Byung Min off, drop Kim, uh, Kim Hyuk to an anchor man, and then drop Fernando here. Uh, Fernando can play the shadow striker, which he loves. And we're going to go uh, structured defensive, and we want to take a breather, waste time, and you know that's all we want to do. That's all we want to do. Just see out the rest of the game. Who cares? We just need to hold on. We've got 10 minutes left. Lee Jung Min's been injured. That's fine. Lucky we saved the sub. Who should we bring on? Uh, who can do a job? That's the question. Ko Min Hyuk, you can do a job. So you can come on. You need some game time. Now, I hope uh, Lee Jung Min isn't injured for too long. That is going to be a problem if he is. Jong Il Kun's looking dead. Here we go. We've got five seconds left on the clock. Surely we've held out. Here's Fernando. It's a 2-0 win against Belena Shizuka. And we have gone through to the next phase of the Champions League. That is fantastic. That is incredible. We've turned around a 2-1 deficit. And we've won 3-2. Lee Jong-su on seven goals now. Pohang have drawn with Shandong. Percy have drawn with Guangzhou. I think that means Guangzhou are now out. That could be huge. So here we go. Al Hilal have dominated 8 2. Al Itihad have taken out Lekiwa. That's good for us. We've won against Belena. Persib have knocked out Guangzhou Evergrande. That is insane. Hopefully we can get Persib. Prasateo. Wow, what are you doing there? The left midfielder. Did we get Prasateo for a bit? He was at Arima for a bit. Was he with us though? I think he was. I think he did play under us for a while. It's good to see he's at Percy, though. Pohang have just edged through against Shandong by a goal. And then FCCL have smashed Ulsan. And Tarakto have beaten Alain, which is a very good for us. So, Lee Jung-min. How long is he out for? Three months with a broken ankle. Oh, no. That's huge. Lee Jung-min, you're a very good player. That's going to hurt his, his growth, too. Oh, no. Three months. So, transfer window, we might need another central midfielder. Alright. We, uh... It's not good. It's not good. So, Kim Jae Yong is from Ulsan Hyundai. He's out too. That's good for us. Fernando, you played very well. You just deserve some praise. Fantastic, mate. I hate how he always gets upset when I praise him. Now, the question is, when's the next draw? Um, I don't have it here. Which is a bit frustrating. 
So maybe we check the calendar. That is the way to go. So we'll go to the schedule here. Go to our calendar. Mm, 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 mm. I haven't got anywhere here. Let's go to June. So it's in June, just before the transfer window. So we don't have to worry about continental football for a while now. Well, it's not really. It really is. So, you know, we've got to play three, five, seven, eight, eight games before you find out the draw, which works out quite well for us. This is where we have our mid-season. We play a lot of K-League Classic games before our Champions League quarter final. So, whether I join you guys or not during this period, I don't know. Maybe I could join you for the Pohang game. We'll see how that goes. But, you know, the Champions League's our focus. We need to worry about it. So, that is it for today's episode, though. You know, I think we've done quite well. We've turned around a deficit. We're progressing in the Champions League. And we do have a quarterfinal in the horizon. But if you've enjoyed the video, don't forget to smash the like button. Subscribe to see more of my Pentagon Challenge. And hopefully I'll catch you guys on another video.